These very people you are seeing in this video are the one helping President Pobia to remain in power. They are the one frustrating Cameroonians. All the poverty we are having today in Cameroon is because of this group of people. If President Paul Beer is able to be in power for 41 years, getting to 42 years, it is because of this particular group of people. They are the one that the government has been using to remain in power. Look at them fighting for food. They're selling their voting rights, their vote for food. It is terrible. Come 2025, there will be a presidential election in Cameroon. And we are out campaigning, especially here on TFA Talking Point, talking about what we have to do in order to remove President Paul Bia from power. Because without President Paul Bia in power, Cameroon will be a prosperous nation. Cameroon will develop within no time. Many things will change in Cameroon if we will be able to take President Paul Bia from power. But the question is, how can we do it? When we have people, millions of Cameroonians are of this kind of people that they can give out their right, they can say their vote just for a bottle of beer, they can say their vote for food, food that they will not even allow them to eat, they have to ask them to go fight over it as animals, like animals. That they will sell their voting right just for a tin of sardine. They will sell their voting right just for a loaf of bread. They will sell their voting right just for 500 francs CFA. How can we do it? The first thing I'm going to tell them all oh, is that it is, the, it is the strategy. Many of you are blaming poverty for this kind of behavior. Many of you are blaming hunger for this kind of behavior. But I'm telling you that hunger, poverty has been the strategy of the CPD and throughout all this year. They struggle by all possible means to keep millions of Cameroon hungry, millions of Cameroons, Cameroonians below poverty lines, just to use them during election. And that is why during election in Cameroon, you usually see these top government officials, these uh, politicians, elites, and traditional rulers coming back to the village with huge sum of money so that they will show it to you and then you will be attracted and you will do everything to run to their meetings and to boycott all opposition meetings, a gathering, supporting them and even voting them. They will tell you if you vote, CBDM, make this sign and come out, take 2,000 francs, you will do it. If you go in there, do this, do this, and come out, show evidence, and take 2,000 francs, you will do it. Frustrating your own life, frustrating the lives of your own children, frustrating the lives of your own great-grandchildren. Great we have to stop this, because the other thing is not hunger. The only thing is not a poverty. The only thing is that we lack a safe a discipline, self-control. This come 2025, what I'm telling you is that you should control yourself. Have self-control. Have self-dignity. So refuse to sell your vote. If you refuse to sell your vote for those things that they are showing to you, you will vote the right person, and the right person will do something in Cameroon that you will be out of that poverty, and you will not be begging for food. You will not be frustrated. You will not be living anyhow. And many of you are asking the question, who then can win vote? When you look at all the opposition leaders, they are not different from President Paul Bia. I'm telling you that why vote for somebody. I am praying that by come 2025, God will give us the sentiment to know the right person that we are going to vote. I am believing that there will be an independent candidate come 2025. And if there will be no an independent candidate, vote for any opposition leaders who is preaching change. If somebody comes in we can pressure that person to change the constitution. A new person comes in, not from the CPDM. A new body. We can pressure the person to change the constitution and stop the unlimited term of office. And when we will have a limited term of office, many people will pass through the presidency within a very short period. 
and that short period, God will bless or somebody genuinely for Cameroonians will pass through and will change Cameroon for better. That is my prayer. And you should vote for somebody who has been with the common people and know the pain of the common people. Not for somebody who has benefited from the system also and just decided to maybe it creates another because most of those opposition parties in Cameroon are branches of CPDM. And those are the issues we are. So pray over it. Why pray? You should register it and collect your voter card. And also struggle by all possible means when the election will be approaching to know where you will vote and also go out to vote. Don't vote and go home. Vote, stay there, sacrifice that day. Use your telephone and your data to secure your foot. This is the preaching we are preaching. We have to stop these people. And also struggle by all possible means to talk with your relatives. Preach to them. Because change, positive mentality is what we are preaching. If we can convince all that they should not be disgracing themselves this way. In the name of their ACPT and militants. In which they deep in their heart they know they are not ACPT and militants. Then we are going to change Cameroon. Thank you very much. If you have just joining us, please do us a favor. Subscribe to our channel. Share the video so that many people will know what we are campaigning for. We are for a better Cameroon. Positive mentality for the Cameroon.